guys, what's going on? It's Savage Gaming here, and today I want to talk about Superman game and what I want. What do I want? I want a villain. <laughs> okay, I was trying to do something else for the intro, but whatever. These are the villains that I want for the Superman game, and some of the reasons. Now, this is just my opinion. I don't think there's going to be a Superman game in the next, like, five years, to be honest. If they announce a Superman game next year, I will flip out. But to be honest... The only people that are going to be making it is WB Montreal or Rocksteady. And WB Montreal has been off for about, what year is it, 2015? If they're going to announce that E3, it's been three years since they made Arkham Origins. So they'll probably release it sometime in October. So yeah, a good three years after Batman Arkham Origins, it would make sense for WB Games Montreal to actually make a Superman game, a Flash game, or a Green Arrow game. Oh my god, my nose. So... Let's get into this. These are the villains that I want and why. Doomsday is number three. Three, Doomsday. Yes, Doomsday. <laughs> Doomsday is that one villain that would just cause mayhem and make Superman think for a second. Now, Superman is a very intelligent character and a lot of people just consider him as a brute force type of guy. He's not. He's almost as smart as Batman. He defeats one of the smartest villains in Ever, you know, he defeats Lex Luthor, basically known to be one of the smartest men in DC in the DC universe, which is insane. So you guys can understand that Doomsday could be like an intellectual, intellectual. I can't say the word, <laughs> like a a villain that Superman would have to think about defeating. You know, how am I gonna defeat this guy? Am I gonna fly him up to space? Am I gonna what am I gonna do? So it would be really cool to see how Superman could actually get into those type of situations with Doomsday. Crash into buildings. I mean, if you guys seen the one like early demo of the game uh, for, what is it, the Superman game that they were going to make, it looked awesome. I mean, like, crashing through buildings, doing quick time events, looked amazing. It was beautiful, and I really, really loved it, because you could just crash through buildings and then just throw Doomsday down the other building. It looked awesome. I don't know who wouldn't want to see that. But, uh, whatever. Number two... And Parasite. Uh, Parasite is a very, 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 very unknown character. I mean, only like the hardcore diehard Superman fans actually know who Parasite is. Uh, you know, I know who Parasite is because of the animated show. I, if I didn't see the animated show, I probably would have never figured out who it was. But considering, you know, he is a uh, he's a decent villain. He, I'm pretty sure he was in the Earth uh, Earth One comics, I think it was, for Volume 2 of Superman. I remember reading Volume 1, but I forgot about Volume 2. But Parasite is a really cool villain. I bet his boss battles would be cool, too. Trying to, like, avoid him as much as possible and fly away from him as much as possible. It would be pretty cool to be, like, a cat and mouse type of game. I would really like to see it. And now, number one. I bet you guys all predicted this. Mr. Mixplix is... <laughs> I can't say it. I can't say it, but I'm serious. The fifth dimensional type of character. Come on. Bring him in. Everybody would love him. It would be insane. How we would make his how we would make him like say his name backwards, I don't know, but they can make that the most campiest boss battle in boss battle history, to be honest. It'd be so funny. Uh like the animated shows where he makes him like uh chase Superman, where Superman makes Mr. Mix <laughs> chase him. And, like, you know, he writes his name backwards, and then Superman twists his head, and then, like, he says, his, and then he reads his name backwards, and then he pops back into the fifth dimension. I thought that was hilarious. I feel like they could totally do that in a video game type of format. And it would be funny and amazing. Don't go off Superman Returns on me and make that a stupid chase scene. No, 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 no. Make Superman being the one being chased. It would be awesome. It would be amazing. And the game would be amazinger if we had a fifth dimensional type of character, and it would show us that, yeah, this type of fantasy is in the Arkhamverse. I mean, if you put this game into the Arkhamverse, it would work perfectly. It would be so amazing, because we know Superman exists. We know Flash exists. We know that uh, Black Canary, Zatanna, Green Arrow, or at least Oliver Queen, uh, you know, Green Lantern. We know all these characters exist, so just hurry up and make a Superman game so we can get to a Justice League game. That would be amazing. Tell me what you guys in the comments below. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and I will see you guys in the next video. Peace out.